and Balance Ranch affords youths the opportunity to live recovered lives and to make the choices they will need to make as they continue on their journey. Located in beautiful southern Arizona, the students are able to find an environment conductive to their recovery. The ranch is different than most facilities in that they offer many different approaches and manners in which it helps its students. They realize that each student is different and people will react to different approaches in various ways. The thing about the ranch is I think we tailor our program to meet the needs of the individual. Um, I know there are some, have been some young guys who come through here that um, due to the kind of family structure they grew up in had a lot of codependency and a lot of things going on with them like that. And so we'll employ um, recovery literature from uh, Codependence Anonymous or something like that to help these young men with additional problems um, they may be having in addition to whatever kind of alcoholism and addiction they have going on. To be successful, you must have the proper state of mind. This is where Inbounds Ranch utilizes its seven guiding principles. When we were in the building phase of this whole dream and idea of Imbalance Ranch, it brought people together at the table from all walks of life. And we said, from your experience, what has worked and what hasn't? And what's the most important criteria that we're trying to meet with these young people? What are we trying to accomplish? And from that, the seven principles were born. They were born with the idea of, we're not going to take anybody in here and fix them. And we're not going to take anybody in here and fix this broken, bad person. We're going to bring young people in here and we're going to help to find the genius that's inside of them. Um, we're going to help them on their path to healing. Um, and so that's a whole centered approach and that's the seven principles. It's about recovery, it's about academics, it's about service to others. Um, it's about what makes up a whole, complete, healthy person. With the school of thought being that the, that the disease of addiction actually is a disease, there's going to be a biological and a physical component behind um, the treatment and the effectiveness in, in, that, type of, in that type of treatment. Um, what I love so much down here is the eclectic approach that we get to take between uh, therapy and then a 12-step approach of how to affect change and, and really to heal the individual. The 12-step program at the ranch has been something we've done here um, since the very beginning. It's been proven repeatedly, um, really since the 1930s, to be a very effective model for recovery and employing that with teenagers is no different than adults. And so the 12-step model actually treats, um, treats the whole human being in the absence of alcohol and helps, uh, helps people to get better. Coming to Imbalance gives its students a unique opportunity to do many things they probably would have never done or seen things they probably would have never seen if they have continued down their current paths. Some of the students here at Inbound Ranch Academy get to participate in a South Africa expedition. It's an opportunity to bring um, a different cultural experience into the students' lives here at Inbound Ranch. You know, the South Africa experience is a lot more than just the sightseeing, because we did that on, the, on these trips. We, you know, we were in Cape Town and Durban and went on a safari and swam in the Indian Ocean and got to do all that. But really the crux of that trip is um, almost the humbling aspect of there are people that, although they don't have anything in terms of financial wealth or even incredible limited education, and they're also lacking uh, what maybe someone here in the States would consider, you know, uh, maybe nice living environments and everything, these people were so happy over there. 